ni kushukuru rais sababu jana wewe na kiongozi wa mahakama ha leadership the chief justice kiongozi wetu wa bunge speaker wetangula na speaker kingi mulifanya mkutano wa dharura na mkakubaliana vile sisi wote wa Kenya tumekubaliana ya kuwa janga la ufisadi limo kwa nchi yetu na mmetuambia kwa siku chache zijazo idara zote za serikali idara ya mahakama bunge executive wenye unaongoza tuweke mikakati ya kuhakikisha ya kuwa ufisadi umetolewa kwa kazi ya umma na nchi yetu na mheshimiwa rais ni kushukuru na ni kuhakikishie ya kuwa sisi katika bunge ile mambo yote ambayo itahitajika tufanye kama wabunge kusaidia kwa vita dhidi ya ufisadi sisi kwa bunge tumo tayari na tutakuwa tayari ili kama ni sheria inahitaji kubadilishwa tutabadilisha kama kuna policy or administrative reforms zitahitajika tuko tayari kuhakikisha kuwa hayo yote yamefanyika wale unasikia mheshimiwa rais wakipinga sisi tukiongea mambo ya ufisadi nataka ni kuambie usiwasikize wale ni watu ambao wamekuwa wakinufaika na ufisadi hata hao soro wanasema wale ulisikia jana wakipinga huo mkutano ni wale ambao wamekuwa wakinufaika na ufisadi na mambo ya kuteka nyara uchumi na nchi yetu kupitia ufisadi therefore your excellency let me just encourage you and congratulate you her leadership the chief justice and our speakers in parliament for the meeting that you had yesterday and your excellency since we are now all agreed as kenyans that corruption state capture are a danger not just to us as a nation today but even to future generations that corruption remains the single most threat to our nation's welfare your excellency we want to thank you for convening the meeting that the judiciary requested and you are all agreed those in the judiciary now agree that corruption is a problem those of us in the legislature agree that we have a problem of corruption in Kenya those of you your excellency serving under your leadership in the executive you have also considered that indeed corruption is a cancer that we must deal with i want to give you the highest assurance your excellency as your majority leader in the national assembly that whatever policy administrative or legislative interventions that you require from parliament we shall be at the forefront of ensuring that those administrative policy or legislative reforms are enacted to help us deal with the uh, cancer and scourge of corruption and state capture in this country your excellency don't worry about those who are making noise at you that you agreed at the request of our judiciary to convene a meeting to discuss the question of corruption your excellency those who are opposed to this discussion are beneficiaries of corruption and state capture past state capture in this country and your excellency since you have told us that we must within a few days or in a month or so be able to have immediate short term and long term interventions your excellency unajua i have a small proposal that i will be bringing to the table that in the medium term to the long term for this country to be able to address the question of corruption we must institute a state capture commission that we will deal decisively with how people who hold offices in this country use their offices to capture the state and perpetuate corruption as the as a norm or as a way of life in public office your excellency i will therefore be presenting proposals your excellency be it to the executive to the judiciary and even to parliament on the establishment of a state capture commission to help us 
to decisively deal with the scourge and the cancer of corruption in our country.